we bring in our Dom Tibbetts, who is live in Dillon at the Western A. Dom, 10 a.m. you've been there since the start of this tournament. How are you feeling? Yeah, Nick, I'm just happy that coffee exists. No, but in all seriousness, it's been an action-packed day here down in Dillon. Every team showcasing why they deserve to be in the Class A state tournament. So let's start our coverage with Polson taking on the host team, Dillon. First set, Pirates still scoreless, but Grace Quiones is going to find some room to drop this ball into. 4-1 to one Beavers. A couple minutes later, Pirates closing the gap. Maggie Dodd hammers this one to cut the Dillon lead to just two. But late in the set, Beavers start to put it away. Ainsley Shipman rides the line and sneaks this ball in play. Then Dillon showing some defense. Josie Jones at the net and says, not in my house. Beavers take the set, but Polson would take this all the way to the fifth set and win 3-2. Next game up, Libby taking on Corvallis. Loggers down one, but not for long. Ember Road finds some open space and fires this one to tie it up at three. Couple minutes later, Corvallis with a nice save, and that turns into some points. Hannah Hutchinson sees open floor and places it perfectly. And late in the set, Libby trying to rally. Sheila Gallagher somehow gets this between two defenders and cuts the lead to six. Set point for the Blue Devils, and Hutchinson doesn't waste the opportunity. Corvallis sweeps Libby in three sets. They'll play Polson in the first quarterfinal tonight at 6 p.m. Over now to the Whitefish Bulldogs going up against the Butte Central Maroons. Opening set, check out this serve from Kaya Moore. Getting a little help from the net. Nothing you can do to defend that. Bulldogs net defense sparks up when this return is stuffed by Peyton Reesinger giving Whitefish some momentum. But back come the Maroons. This ball is kept alive at the net and then Emma Keeley does the rest. Sends this one to the back corner for a point. And Butte Central flashing some net defense of their own. Marissa Anderson with the rejection. Maroons go on to sweep Whitefish and will play the winner of Columbia Falls and Stevensville tonight at 8. And be sure to tune back here at 10 o'clock tonight. We're the only people that are going to have Corvallis, Polson, and Butte Central versus Columbia Falls. 10 o'clock tonight right back here. But I'm going to send it back to you for now, Nick.